am Father Thomas Rajamanikam from the place of Pundimada Basilica. I originally belonged to Pundimada Basilica Parish. However, I am working in the Catholic Diocese of Indo, Madhya Pradesh. I would like to share my views on Pundimada Basilica. Pundi Mada Basilica is a miraculous place. Many pilgrims come to this place to render thanks to the Blessed Virgin Mary for the favors received and they place their favors in front of the Lord through the powerful intercession of Blessed Virgin Mary. Pundi Mada Basilica had its origin in 1714 to 1718. It is a wonderful place with a beautiful nature between two important rivers, Kaveri and Kolidam. This place has a natural setting of coconut groves and paddy fields. It was Reverend Father Constantine Besky who came here in the period 1714 to 1718 and established a small chapel in honor of the Immaculate Conception of Blessed Virgin Mary. From then onwards, people had special devotion to Blessed Virgin Mary, who is the Mother of God who is mother of all of us. Pundimada Basilica is a famous place for miracles and people come in large number to have their devotion to Blessed Virgin Mary and they pray in silence and they worship the Lord through the powerful intercession of Blessed Virgin Mary, they place their prayers, petitions, and all other needs which they would like to seek from the Lord. Mother Mary is a mother to all of us, who is Mother of God, who is the powerful intercessor for all the Christians. Pundimada Basilica is a famous place where a lot of miracles are experienced by the pilgrims. They come here with a lot of hope. The statue which we see at the Basilica is a miraculous statue. It was brought from France after the apparition of Blessed Virgin Mary to St. Bernadette in 1858. Many statues were made after the apparition and were sent to different parts of the world. Three statues were brought to India and one of the statues was brought to Pundimada Basilica. And it is kept at the chapel which was built by Reverend Father Constantine Besky S.J. The basilica grew in, a, in its heights when Reverend Father Luther Xavier was appointed as the parish priest in 1955. He was a saintly priest who had the gift of prediction and the gift of healing. He always told the devotees to go and tell and whisper the prayers and the petitions to Blessed Virgin Mary. And they prayed and surrendered and they whispered their needs and Pundi Mada, the miraculous mother, granted them 
through the power through her powerful intercession the lord jesus had worked plenty of miracles through pundimada and that was the experience of people and large number of crowd came to this basilica and the crowd is increasing people come from various places from tamil nadu from different places of india and moreover all over the world people come to pray to gain peace and to place their petitions it was for me a special gift to come to pundimada basilica when i was a child i used to come to this place to pray my father's place is michael patti and we used to come here to pray constantly and because of that i was inspired by mother mary and i became priest i became a missionary priest in the mission diocese of indo when i was praying to blessed virgin mary at the basilica after praying three rosaries before my ordination to priesthood i prayed to her that my ordination should be held inside the basilica miraculously blessed virgin mary the miraculous mother of god granted me this favor after my diaconate ordination our family migrated to pundi through the help of reverend father susai and we settled here 26 years ago miraculously i was ordained inside the basilica as the first priest of pundi mada basilica parish with the presence of two bishops and many priests and thousands of people this is a miracle my dear friends my dear devotees when you come with faith and pray to the miraculous mother of pundi your prayers are answered because she is the mother of all of us my dear friends and devotees you come to this place you will see wonders you will have peace you will go back always with the power of god almighty through the intercession of pundimada